Tommy, FA Cup weekend, first round is a magical time for us last year. Do you reckon we can do anything similar this year? Oh, if we go anywhere close, we'll be over the moon. Um, obviously, it's a, it's a big weekend because it's the first round proper. And we're delighted to be in there, to be honest. And um, We're going into this game exactly the same as we did last game. Um, we're hoping for the same outcome. Obviously, the scoreline is never going to be repeated. So, you know, if we can be in the game... From from the minute from minute one as we would be, um, we just we just got to see where it takes us. To be honest with you, but we're we're going up there. Really good preparation this week. Um, we're lucky enough to be able to stop at a, a good training ground on the way up there um, and stay over the night before the game. So we're, we're looking forward to all all aspects of it. Like you said, a lot of the players who are still here can draw on the, the memories of last season and obviously mm-hmm. our trip firstly to Swindon. But not just that, we had a couple more to follow, and we'd all like a little bit more. Yeah, as you say, it's a very tough draw, isn't it? Going up to Bradford, long journey, but as a big club as well. It's going to be a big stadium and a lot of fans there. So, you know, it's going to be tough, but, you know, we did it last year. So, hey, Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think we, certainly the staff, but also the players, I don't think they're going to be phased by the occasion. I think a lot of our players have played in decent stadia and, and against uh, in front of big crowds. But I hope the, the good people of Bradford turn out, because I know that the people of Old Shot will, will travel in their numbers. Um, with hope and we'll be the same so what i will say is we'll be we'll be giving it our all and, and trying as best we can to to be in a hat on monday obviously in the last round we got a good win against bath city last minute winner by maxi mullins it, it was an opportunity for someone on the periphery to make a name for themselves do you think that is something that can happen again this weekend <clears throat> well there's this in this round of the cup we can have nine subs so yeah. and five to pick from the nine um so the there's going to be a lot of lads involved and hopefully we can get as many on the pitch as possible. But ultimately, the, the way the game goes will shape what changes are made. Um, like I said, we've had a really good week in terms of preparation. The lads have looked sharp and well um, and we go up there in good spirit. So we'll be giving it our all. And with Brighton in the National League Cup on, on Tuesday, it gives us a good opportunity to move away from the league and, and you know build some confidence again, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean, look, we've lost one in the last five and we've, we've won three of them. So... There's not a, not a lot of panic going on inside here. I, I know there's a lot of outside noise, but I don't listen to that anyway. Um, we've just got to carry on and know and believe in what we're doing, believe in the lads that we've got here doing what they're, what they're trying to do. And I, I'm a big believer. I get out of bed every day believing we're going to win the next game. And, and I want, that's, that's what I want for my players. We've been able to have a, 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 as much of a full week of training as you can probably get at this time in the season. So how's it been this week? Has the lads been good out there? It's been good. We've been Numbers have been added to by... The return of one or two from fairly long-term injuries, so it's been nice to see them faces back on the on the training ground. Um, there has been a little bit of a, a bug going around the place, and one or two people, staff and and players, have uh, have been a little bit under the weather. But that was earlier on in the week, um, and all of us staff have been out to watch games earlier in the week too. So yeah, it's been busy. Whilst there hasn't been as as much in terms of the football to report on for yourselves without the midweek. People are going to look forward and see that the next three of the next four Tuesdays there'll be games. So like you said, when you spoke to me about three weeks ago, we'd progressed really well in all three competitions in the Cup. Let's hope when you speak to me in another week or two's time, then we'll, we'll still be in all three Cup competitions. Cheers, Tom. Yeah.